understanding my legacy. And my siblings in arms are formation of symmetry behind me and in front of me. So we stand in command with pens and posters to see. I can't help but look back at my journey of poetry. Because whilst under this spotlight I stand alone, and I interpret these truths extra well. From silent chrysalis to cocoon too small, I've grown a monarch maker floods as I give away throats. But only the maker knew what would come of this. Crying in my car, overlicking a mental precipice. To sipping from the venomous dregs of the chalice. To turning to a park of boxes and to a speaker's palace. Twice a month now. But how I mean to go on is how I started. To speak truth to existence and note the departed. In trouble the canted tales of the highly regarded exposed ugliness and sleaze that remain good hearted. And I venerate the creator whilst loving the creators who animate the tongue stories translated from triumph and trauma to something innovative. Stories stated and dictates to leave us elated. I see. I remain humble until I'm not supposed to be. Because I look at my show and take it to the top of a unique view. See, I won't stop until BYOB goes international and I love this game. This is irrational. So I look back to Guy, but he's ahead of me. Forgive myself so heaviness is seized by levity. I'm achieved and goals to come to life's brevity. And when I die, bury me virtue. So I stand in my fucking legacy.